guys, so today I'm going to be doing a video on how to use an LCD display uh, by connecting it to an Arduino Mega. I'm not sure if it's possible to make the same thing with an Arduino Uno, but you can try, you can look it up. But I'm using an Arduino Mega because it was part of the Elegoo kit, so it makes things much easier. But um, you're always welcome to try with other kinds of Arduino. So let's get started. So the components we will need are an LCD display, a potentiometer. We will use the potentiometer from the Elego kit, so a 10K potentiometer, and then uh, some male-to-male -male jump wires and uh, um, the Arduino Mega and then a breadboard. So this is the wiring diagram and uh, one really important thing that we actually don't need to forget is to wire the yellow jumper wire because the yellow jumper wire connects uh, uh, the potentiometer to the LCD display and uh, the reason why we need this potentiometer is because it regulates the contrast um, of the display. So uh, we might think that our code uh, is not working or that our wiring is wrong if um, for example the message doesn't show up on the LCD display well actually it might be a problem of the potentiometer so maybe the potentiometer is uh, providing too little contrast Till I get up, time is barely on our side. I don't wanna waste what's left. The storms we chase are leading us, and love is all we'll ever trust. Yeah, no, I don't wanna waste what's left. And on and on we'll go through the wastelands, through the highways, till my shadow. Turns the sun rays and on and on we'll go through the wastelands, through the highways, and on and on we'll go. Okay, let's see how we made it possible to print Hello World into the LCD display. So uh, we got this code from the tutorial, so yes, I didn't come up with this, but yes, here is the code. And it's actually very short and very easy to understand, I have to say. So first thing that happens in this code is to include this library, liquidcrystal.h, which will allow us to um, do some things in the code that we will see. Like, for example, um, saying liquid crystal and then LCD and all of these numbers, which are the pins. So this first um, statement here, this first line here, uh, just tells uh, the Arduino um, which pins of the Arduino we are using uh, for the LCD display, so which uh, pins are connected to it. Uh, then we have the void setup, uh, which runs only once, and um, what runs only once is basically the the 
printed message hello world and what is happening here is first to say lcd begin 16 comma 2 which means that we're saying um to write the message in 16 columns and two rows so we first say the columns and then we say the rows so the message will be written um, in 16 columns and two rows that means basically that the LCD display can have 16 characters for each row and two rows which makes it possible to have 32 characters and comprised of spaces um, and then um, we just print this message and that's why we will just see this message not disappearing at any point uh, because um, it's just a setup and it stays like that um, then we have the void loop where something is actually changing in the display um, so what happens is that what changes is this kind of counting um, so it goes yeah I think it's it's uh, the number of seconds since reset the number of seconds since reset so basically what happens is that this number of seconds since reset is being printed by this function lcd print and um, then uh, this uh, sets the cursor meaning that it tells the lcd display not to write on the first row but on the second so as we've said before the first number here in this function is indicating the rows and uh, sorry the columns and this one is indicating the rows so if we say set cursor zero that means that we are starting in the first column um, and if we say set cursor one so the the first row that's uh, actually at in the so the second row we're actually saying second row but the index is one because um the very first row has index zero and the the second row therefore has index one so every time we count we just have to uh minus one uh for each row to understand what index it is and yeah um, this is basically it the working circuit where the lcd displays hello world on the first row and on the second row we have uh, the uh, count so this uh, is a count of seconds from the last reset Close till I get up Time is barely on our side I don't wanna waste what's left The storms we chase are leading up